Happy Water Wednesday, y'all. Today we're talking about the Germantown water crisis. This all started when there was a power outage from one of those July storms where Germantown's water treatment plant went offline. They had to use a diesel powered generator to keep the water treatment plant going. Since power was out for over 36 hours there, they needed to refuel that diesel. One of their employees came, was refilling the diesel, walked away and eventually that diesel overflowed the tank by what is estimated at 300 gallons. That employee did not report the spill. Fast forward a day later on July 20th, residents were calling the city of Germantown saying they smelled gas in their taps. Eventually they realized it was the diesel spill. What we've gathered to date is that there is a pipe connecting that water treatment plant to the reservoir that had a hole in it just downhill from that generator. Diesel fuel spilled directly into the city's water supply, tainting over 40,000 people's water and a major hospital, making that water unavailable for any use. You can't even boil it. Protect Our Aquifer got involved early on, urging more public communication and to try to figure out how to clean this up faster. 